18 laps, it's the second F1 sprint, and it's lights out, away we go, Bottas gets away well, as does Max Verstappen, and Hamilton's trying to cut him off, and also Hamper, Lando Norris as well, and he's losing out, it's Hamilton here, and Valtteri Bottas leads by Max Verstappen into the first chicane, then comes Daniel Ricciardo, then Lando Norris, Pierre Gasly, and Lewis Hamilton, who's had a bit of a shocker at the start, and has gone back four places, the two Alpines are battling each other, and there's damage there to Pierre Gasly, is Alfa Tari as his front wing comes off and he crashes at the Curva Grande. He'd slowed down quite dramatically and by the time he hit the barriers, but Gasly is out after winning here 12 months ago. Going to need a safety car. It isn't deployed now. Safety car deployed. We've got a spinner as well at the exit of the second chicane. That's Get one it. of the Alfa Romeos. I think that's Robert Kubica. So he's gone around the hours. Oh, look, he's clipped the back of the McLaren, broken his wing. That's where the damage was done. And now the wing, you can see the wing sparking down on underneath the left tire. As he turns in, he's not going to have the front grip. The wing goes underneath the front axle and then you're on to the gravel. That is what spun Robert Kubica around, got tapped by Yuki Tsunoda. This is the sixth time we've had a safety car on the opening lap this season. Safety cars disappeared for a while now, though, and we can get racing again. And Valtteri Bottas has made the jump, and he's got a very good start. Ahead of Max Verstappen, Daniel Ricciardo in third place. Then comes Lando Norris and Lewis Hamilton. Behind Hamilton, Charles Leclerc and Carlos Sainz making a move. It's Fernando Alonso and Sebastian Vettel a bit further back. And also looking at the house of Mick Schumacher. Alonso and Vettel squabbling as they go into that first chicane and over the bar goes Fernando Alonso. I don't think there was contact between the two experienced drivers and former winners here, of course, in Monza, but they got very close. Yeah, and as Paul pointed out, you know, for McLaren now, they've done two laps less on those tyres at high speed, so it's working for them. The Ferraris then line astern and uh, down in sixth and seventh place, and still people locking up into the second chicane. It's all kicking off at the back of the field. Uh, there goes Fernando Alonso into the first of the Lesmo corners. He has passed Sebastian Vettel, and he's now making his charge as George Russell moves past Mick Schumacher. And George Russell needs to be ahead of Nikita Mazepin as far as he's concerned into the first chicane, and he has done so. So Russell uh, back up into 15th place. The race hasn't worked out so well for Sergio Perez, except here he comes, and there's good, that's going to be tight for space, and it's rough across there. He now has to let Stroll go back past. Fine going wheel to wheel, but then Perez runs out of racetrack, and, and you can't just rejoin and stay ahead like that. Check out, give it back, we'll get him next lap. So he does give it back into the Ascari chicane. Will he get him on the next lap? As his engineer, Hugh Bird, said, he's going to go to the left-hand side once again. On the inside, Lance Stroll, Perez under braking a little bit later, does manage to get it. Fernando Alonso is looking to pounce, but he is kept at bay by Lance Stroll as Perez moves ninth, Stroll tenth. Let's just watch on board with Lewis Hamilton. Whee. Wow, that's a lot of oversteer in a modern Formula One car. Uh, he's a little bit high on the line, but uh, yeah, just lit up the rear tyres. Welcome back to winning ways for Valtteri Bottas as well in the week where he leaves Mercedes and it's announced that he leaves Mercedes. He goes on to take the first of the two races here at Monza this weekend. Bottas wins the sprint. Max Verstappen comes home to take second place and uh, a point for third and a very fine third for Daniel Ricciardo in the McLaren. His teammate Lando Norris next across the line. He's the one that kept Lewis Hamilton at bay. Hamilton started on the front row, comes home to Finish fifth, he'll start on the second row for the Italian Grand Prix. Behind them will come the two Ferraris of Charles Leclerc and Carlos Sainz holding off Sergio Perez all the way to the line is Antonio Giovinazzi. He finishes eighth, Perez ninth, Lance Stroll will finish tenth. Uh, and so far, it's not gone that well for Mercedes, these sprint qualifiers. It's gone very well for Max Verstappen, though. He'll start tomorrow's race at the front. Valtteri Bottas wins and takes a penalty into the Grand Prix. Hamilton will start on the second row.